It was a busy day at the state house after three hours of debate and multiple amendments. The governor's government reorganization bill is now a step closer to becoming law. Just one Democrat, Tony Bisignano of Des Moines, voted with Republicans to pass the plan. Governor Reynolds applauded the move, saying in a statement, for too long, politicians have only promised to reduce the size and cost of government. But today, the Iowa Senate took an important step toward making it a reality. The plan would reduce the total number of cabinet level departments from 37 to 16. It would also combine different state systems and technologies and centralize government programs like the Department for the Blind. New tonight, one legally blind high school student is sharing her disappointment and her message for Iowa lawmakers. They provide me with everyday skills that I need under this new reconstruction plan. I just worry that all of the all of the backbone to who the Department for the Blind is and everything they stand for is going to get pushed to the side for a political agenda. Republicans argue there will be more consistency and accountability, not just for the blind Iowans, but for everyone.